excuse me, you can see there are some isolated high totals, but it's not a washout for every single location. So that's what we're going to be watching. Of course, we're watching the tropics. It's getting into the peak of hurricane season. The peak is officially around the 10th or so or the second week of September. Uh, three areas have got my attention out here. Two are being highlighted by the Hurricane Center. That one's not being highlighted, but it's been a persistent area of showers and storms the past 24 hours, so wouldn't be surprising if that's a short-lived system. But this one right here, it's something I want to watch long term, and here's what I mean by that. It's not going to do anything or be our problem for us anytime soon, if it ever is. This is going to be moving west through the Caribbean this week. It'll be near the Yucatan by this weekend, and then early next week it's going to get into the southern Gulf. And there's still some uncertainty on what it might do once it's in the southern Gulf. Some models take it straight into Central America and Mexico and just kill it off. That would be great news. Others bring the area of moisture into the southern Gulf. We have a cool front coming down. This means there will be extra showers and storms in the Gulf by the early part of next week. And then some guidance does suggest that maybe that moisture gets pulled to the north towards the end of next week. Once again, that's a week and a half from now, so we will have to just see how this plays out. It's too early to say what exactly happens, and it's just hurricane season, so you got to watch those types of things. With this, though, we are expecting the heavy rain to be passing through Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Weather impact alert days, primarily Wednesday and Thursday right now. We may add Friday. We'll give it a couple more days before we do that. And the beautiful weather for the weekend. Look at your Sunday and Monday mornings. That's almost chilly weather on the North Shore in the low 60s on the South Shore in the low 70s. The marine forecast today's fine, but tomorrow and Thursday are not going to be as good because of the rain. Your high tide will happen during the daytime hours and your low tide will happen late tonight.